This is George from High Tech Legion. Today we're going to take a look at the Icy Dock Blizzard 3.5 SATA external hard drive enclosure. The Blizzard 3.5 is actually a very interesting piece. 3.5 inch SATA hard drive enclosure that features SATA 3 and has an active 80mm fan to keep your hard drive cool. Take a look at the box. Very nice packaging from Icy Dock. Good clear picture of the unit on the front on an all black box with a little bit of blue smoke. Down the bottom you do get a list of some of the features, but as you see, it comes in two different models, an eSATA and a Firewire model, and all the features are listed for both. So that does become a little confusing down there, but it does list SATA 3, USB 3, USB 2, plug and play, fan, which are all going to be consistent on both models. Uh, other interesting thing about the 80mm fan is that it is auto-adjusting and does adapt its speed to the temperature of the hard disk drive. Going over to the side of the box, we get a nice rear view of the two different units, FireWire unit on the left and the USB 3 and eSATA unit on the right. Around the other side of the box, we get a look at the cooling mechanism. 80mm uh, fan, which sits on the side of the uh, enclosure itself, which is going to blow air through. Typically, you're going to have a blue LED light, which is adjustable, it is dimming, uh, which will turn to red LED when the temperature of the hard disk drive reaches over 50 degrees centigrade. Uh, you've got the device power light, hard drive activity light. You've also got smart cooling technology with a fan switch control for high, low, or auto. Once again, you can run the fan on high, run it on low, or let it automatically adjust by the temperature. The cool ambient blue light with adjustable LED brightness. Brightness is done by a uh, wheel type switch which will adjust the brightness continually. On the back we have a quick spec chart as well as a nice picture of the Blizzard 3.5 actually opened up. Fan off, hard drive going in. It is a tool for installation, very very simple. Um, as I say, quick and dirty specification chart, dimensions, weight, power supply, cooling system, 80mm uh, fan obviously, compatibility, Windows, Mac OS, uh, etc. Just basically all laid out there for you, 3 terabyte plus on compatibility. Moving inside the box, we're going to look at the Blizzard 3.5 itself. Very interesting looking piece. As you can see, done in all black, and with the 80mm fan in front, You've got a bit of a bulge, so star shape in the front, around the sides, and notched on the top, across the fan of course, moving to the back, fan switch, LED adjustment wheel for the brightness, USB 3 connector, eSATA connector, on off switch, power input. See around the bottom, got two feet which snap into place and are packaged obviously separately and need to be installed. And looking on the sides, you see we've got on each side a button. Depressing the two buttons and pulling out will remove the fan. Taking a look at the fan assembly, as you can see, 80 millimeter fan inside and of course completely vented in the front for a good pass through of the air. Drive installation in the Blizzard 3.5 is about as simple as you could possibly imagine. To press the two buttons on the side of the unit, fan pops out, put your disk drive in with the connectors facing the right side. When I say right I do mean correct, not necessarily the right hand side push it into place, you'll feel the connectors click into place. Push the fan back in place until the two snaps on the side click and your drive is installed. Just doesn't get any simpler. With the unit running, you get a look at the blue LED. It's actually backlit. It is not an LED fan. The lighting actually comes from the rear of the case from two LEDs in the rear. Adjusting it down, you can get it very dim or bring it back up. Either way, it is absolutely not over, uh, overpowering in any way or form. Uh, nothing like an LED fan, which is going to make your entire desk glow. Uh, just really adds a bit of a glow when you're looking into it. In terms of accessories, find a user manual, 
which is completely illustrated. Makes it very easy to understand exactly what everything does as well as how to install user manual also in many different languages. AC plug, USB 3 cable, and even an eSATA cable is included. The Blizzard 3.5 external uh, hard drive enclosure, very nice looking unit, really well finished, nice black plastic finish, fins across the top, extend into the front and across the back. Uh, two push buttons on the side on the star shaped design with the fan out front. Really nice thing about the fan, uh, 80 millimeter fan is going to keep the air constantly blowing onto your hard disk, making sure you don't overheat blue LED light on the fan, which is going to turn red if your hard disk drive gets over 50 degrees centigrade. Fan speed controllable, automatic adjusting, so it's going to run at a slower speed, add cooler temperatures, higher speed at uh, hotter temperatures, or manual higher low setting. Taking a look around the back, connectors very well laid out, fan selector switch, LED, control knob, USB 3 connector, eSATA connector, on off, power switch, really just a nice looking piece, very well built, definitely has some heft to it. Uh, IC Dock makes some excellent quality pieces, even if they are simpler pieces like uh, an external hard drive enclosure or even their internal uh, drive holders are always, always very excellent quality pieces. Really nice looking piece from IC Dock, the Blizzard 3.5.